What's up, I'm Moana Turtle, and today we're doing some more Hidden Fates, of course. I think at this point we've opened like 8 boxes, so that's like 32 pa oh man, that's... No, uh, 24! <laughs> 24 packs, and still have yet to get a shiny GX, which is absurd, so what can we do but keep trying? We got two more, this time we just got two Mew collections. Uh, maybe that'll make the difference. Don't have a even number of both the boxes, so... Here we'll crack into two of these. So let's see, how is this set doing? Uh, that Charizard still go holding at that $400 mark. I am super impressed. Uh, maybe it's harder to pull than I expected, and maybe just the supply is not is not there. And uh, yeah, it seems to be holding. People have asked, like, oh, should I sell mine? Um. I think like if I were to pull one, I definitely wouldn't sell it, even if the price were to go down. Like I'll still hold on to it. If I had multiples, maybe. So, you know, maybe I'm not sure if that helps at all, but I would definitely hold on to at least a couple. You know, I think definitely would want to get them great, especially if you think you could get a 10. Like if the raw is selling for 400, imagine what the PSA 10 is going to go for once the price settles. All right, we got our six packs. Got the couple Mews. This one actually is really useful with that bench barrier. I feel like I've never seen anyone use the Mine Report Mewtwo, but uh, this guy is a staple just to protect the bench. Got these little collections. So we are doing another giveaway. The giveaway winner will be announced on Wednesday. All you have to do is check out the video from yesterday uh, towards the end of this video like when they kind of have those screens I'll make sure that's one of them and to enter all you have to do is be subscribed to the channel like the video and leave a comment hashtag turtle giveaway scroll down through the comments and you'll see a bunch of them <laughs> so it's not too hard to figure out and all right first pack will we finally get our first shiny GX here we go fighting energy Scyther, Charmeleon, Metapod, Caterpie, Eevee, Ekans, Charmander, Psyduck, Bill's Analysis, that is now a rare. It's really interesting, they turned all like the supporters into rares. And a, ooh, Reverse Charmeleon, that's not bad. There is a Shiny Charmeleon, which would obviously <laughs> take, uh, which, which would be preferable. But, uh, alright, nothing on that first pack. We're gonna keep going. Uh, yeah, so not only just to enter the giveaway, but if you're not already subbed to the channel, definitely hit that sub button if you like Hidden Fates or anything Pokemon related. Uh, we do tons of Pokemon content. Uh, we do a lot of stuff where there's new cards announced, uh, Japanese openings, uh, tons of good stuff. PTCGO every once in a while. And another just regular rare. And then Brock's Pewter City Gym. Ooh, another dud box, it seems. We got one last shot for our first box. But uh, we also opened some different TCGs, Yu-Gi-Oh, Magic the Gathering, stuff like that. So if you're not already sub, definitely hit that sub button. Here we go for the last pack. Can we finally get something good? Metal Energy. Misty's Gym. Sabrina, okay, not all of the supporters are rare. Metapod. Charmander, Voltorb, Coughing, Ekans, Cubone, oh nice! This was definitely one of the ones I wanted. Alright, this, this box came through Giovanni's Exile. Not a very good card, but I just really like this card. There was, there was no full art previously, and oh man! <laughs> Our last pack was super loaded. We got Type Null as well. I think this is the second Type Null I've got, so I'm not crazy about that. There's so many shinies to collect, so any doubles that are not like, I don't know, like a base or something really cool is uh, not, it's a little disappointing, but hey, we'll take any shinies. Our pulls, I feel like, have been mediocre at best, so that is a win. To be honest, like, if we didn't pull anything else, that would be kind of like how our all our videos have been, like a couple good hits, one or two good hits, and that's it. Very nice. Come on. Oh, it's upside down. Alright, so from the base set versus the shiny vault, it's kind of weird, but uh, there's still one more full art that I really want. It would be that Jesse and James. And we got three more cracks. 
let's see, we obviously want the Zard. Uh, the birds, we pulled the full art and the regular. So all that's left is that rainbow one. Although, to be honest, I like the the full art one. I like looking at the full art one better than the the rainbow. I feel like it's a little more aesthetically pleasing to the eyes for myself. We got Brock's Gym, Koga's Trap, LT Surge, Clefairy, Cubone, Jigglypuff, Eevee, Caterpie. Oh, is this the rare? Ah, Blaine's Last Stand. And boom! Oh, oh nice! A gold card! Alright, these, now our openings are getting to what I wanted. Man, there's so little texture on this card. Gold cards are really cool. This one, I'm, I'm not crazy about, or at least, um, I feel like I pull a lot of Tapu Finis, not many Tapu Bulus. Obviously, the biggest one would be that Lele. Let me grab a perfect fit for this as well. Alright, so this might be our best Hidden Fates opening yet. Still no shiny GXs, but we got our first gold card, which is gold and shiny like... I feel like to me they're at the same level because it's not like there's some golds that are shiny or there's no overlap between the two between the cards so very happy with this pull I love this art style how it's just kind of like the shading really cool all right two packs left ah this is the first time I'm really happy with our opening results so we persevered till we got it do me a favor guys, hit that like button down below for finally a good Hidden Fates opening. Here we go, we got two more packs. Charmeleon, we pulled that reverse one already. Chansey, Giovanni's Exile, we already got him. We got Slowpoke, Pikachu, Charmander, Electrode, and then a Mew. Whenever it's a regular rare, I just skip right over it. Oh, that's a, that's a cute card, is that a, that's a rare, oh, I like that. It is a very unimpressive card, but I'm going to toss this in a sleeve. I feel like that art is very nice. Alright, last pack. Motorcycles going on outside. If it's really noisy, I apologize. I did open the windows because it's nice, nice and cool outside. Alright, last pack magic. Here we come. Ooh, there is a Nick on that corner. Oh man, Nick on this corner as well. All right, Giovanni again, Tennis Surge, Koga, we got all the supporters, Magikarp, Slowpoke, Clefairy, Coughing, ooh, Vaporeon, Foil. Let's see what this guy does. Uh, this must be from the family game thing, because this is super vanilla card. And then a Clefairy. All right, so if this was like the Charizard, that would be super bittersweet just because look at look at all his nicks but uh it wasn't one thing it was not anything special so all right i consider this our best opening yet although we did pull a mount coronet but um yeah i like this one better by a significant margin to be honest we got mew reverse not a great hit but oh look at that i love that art yeah, if there's a particular art that you are a big fan of that's not a GX, it's not a shiny in this set, let me know. Just because, like, there's some different cards in here that are the first time printing, so, you know, I feel like it's, it's, there is some art to appreciate, and while we're all focused on the shinies and stuff, we can easily overlook it. So if there's a particular one you want to for us to recognize, let us know in a comment down below. We got Tapu Bulu gold card, our first gold card, and then Giovanni's Exile, definitely one of the ones I wanted to get. Still looking for that Jesse and James, but I think Giovanni is the one I wanted more. So really, pr really happy with the results of this opening. And uh, yeah, if you guys want to enter the giveaway for a one of these pin collection boxes, uh, just make sure you check out yesterday's video and uh, just go to it. Um, make sure you subscribe, hit the like button, and leave a comment with hashtag turtle giveaway, and you will be entered. We'll select the winner on Friday morning. You'll see a vid for that, but. Uh, yeah, that's it for today, guys. As always, thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support on the channel. I'm Moana Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time.